I used Mero as my primary source for the preparation uh, of uh, NEET PG and INICT examinations. Uh, preparation from Mero, I can divide it in uh, various parts. Like the first is uh, videos and notes. So I used videos and notes in my final year on. Fi from my final year onwards, I have used Mero notes for all 19 subjects for preparation from uh, Mero only. The second part is uh, question bank. So I started using question bank from the final year onwards. Uh, and the third part is Mero Pulse. So the Mero Pulse are excellent. I find them very uh, useful. Uh, actually, there are 200, uh, 2000 something Pulse in Mero. I have bookmarked 700 or 800 uh, of Pulse. So uh, like I came to know about one latest feature of Mero app that is schema. So in the last month of my preparation, I came to know that one schema feature is added to Mero app. So if uh, like I use like in this way, if I want to do one Kawasaki question, so it is very difficult to find from that question module, but I can directly find that Kawasaki two or three question from pediatrics uh, rheumatology module and like that so it was very helpful uh, in Mero videos like in anatomy uh, anatomy videos are has explained everything with uh, visual aid so anatomy uh, anatomy is explained with animation modules and that so they are very useful in obstetric gynec videos also Mema has explained uh, mechanism of labor and breast delivery maneuvers with the help of demonstration and that so we have one visual impression of what is actually uh, going on in the clinical practice so that are very useful Hello everyone, my name is Dr. Nisarg Sajani. I have done my MBBS and internship from BJ Medical College, Ahmedabad. I have got uh, rank 7 in NEET PG 2022 examination this year. I also secured rank 33 in INICT examination this year. I am a Plan C user uh, of Mero from the beginning of my preparation. I completed my internship in February 2021 last year. Uh, so July 2021 INICT last year was the first exam I was eligible for and I gave that exam. I got rank 73 in last year INICT also. Uh, and actually I did take up a seat, so I was doing residency there, I did not give up, uh, give any uh, NEET or INICT examination last year. Uh, I left that seat in uh, December 2021 and uh, I started preparing again from January onwards. And in this year INICT I got rank 33 and NEET PG I got rank 7 uh, this year. Actually, uh, I was not very focused on cracking entrance exam from the beginning of my preparation. So I read all of the standard textbooks and uh, that are available for all the subjects till my uh, third first. So in th from the third final year, I got to know about Mero from one of my senior and I bought the plan C. And from my final year onwards, I am using Mero extensively for my preparation for uh, entrance examination. For the question bank, uh, I used to solve question bank not with the videos like if I, am, if I am seeing videos for medicine I used to solve question bank for surgery uh, because it helps in preparation it helps a, it like we can prepare two subjects at the same time so that was I that, that is how I was using question bank for Mero and I have completed almost 70 to 80 percent of question bank for all the subjects so first grant test I gave in my free pre-final year just to know what my preparation is I got rank around 3000 4000 rank in that and from uh, I regularly started giving grant test in my uh, internship year I used to give grant test every 15 to 30 days uh, like that is two to three grant test uh, in, a, in a month I used to give all grant tests when they are live because that is the best way to give it. One thing about grant test is if you are not able to solve the grant test, just uh, don't give it. If you are give that many grant tests that uh, you are able to solve, like if you are able to solve two to three grant tests in a month and give only two to three grant tests, no need to give five or seven grant tests in a month if you are not able to solve it. So solving grant tests is very important and Mero grant tests have extensive solutions behind, extensive solution after each question. So uh, grant solving grant test is uh, itself a part of a preparation. Grant test is just to know how, how much our preparation is, what, what subjects we are lacking in and uh, to know our weak points and strong points. So use grant test for just analysis. No, do not use grant test that I have got this rank, I will get this rank in NEET PG. So it is not that you have to predict rank from grant test. Grant test is a pro process of learning. So you have to give grant test uh, just to know your preparation and from each grant test you learn something, you learn 200 new topics and you you should be very clear about the 200 topics. Actually all faculties are favorite but uh, if, if I have to pick two or three then uh, I have used, I, Rakesar is my favorite uh, in for medicine, uh, Ron Kandelwal sir for surgery, Shaksiro Amem for gynec and uh, biochemistry, Rebecca Amem's is best. Uh, there are two to three features of Mero which I find very, uh, very useful. The one is Mero Pulse, 
the second is custom module and the third the third feature is a schema that mer have recently introduced that is very useful if you want to search any topic uh, from any question bank we you can uh, search directly from that so it is very useful mero delta videos uh, and revision videos i used in last time of my preparation mero delta videos i used to see one every day before uh, inict 30 days before inict so actually they are very high yielding and very recent topics are covered in delta videos so i find delta videos very useful for mero revision video i would say that i have used uh, like pediatric revision videos and surgery revision videos surgery revision videos are very good actually you can revise uh, almost all uh, almost entire surgery in very uh, one to two days only our own cardiologist has covered almost everything of, uh, in revision videos so revision videos are also very helpful i used to have uh, two two notes one is the main mero notes and the second is uh, revision notes that i have prepared for, by myself Rakesh's endocrine notes is uh, 100 pages, so I have made my notes, which is uh, 10 to 20 pages only. So I can revise endocrine so endocrine system in half a day. So uh, what one advice I will give to my junior is: don't keep on searching for many sources. Just prepare from one source and stick to it because it is very helpful in the revision also. Actually, I uh, find surgery very difficult uh, in my final year, but when I see Ron Kanelwar's sur- sur- explanation of various surgical sur- surgery concept that. Uh, I find it very useful and very Ron uh, Kanelwar sir has made, made surgery just very easy. I watched all the videos from Mero for final year subjects and I used to watch revision videos in 2x speed. So I uh, when when I feel tired or that I will uh, just plug in my earphone and I will uh, I will watch revision videos at 2x speed. In the free time I used to watch Netflix and that I used to talk with my friends I go, used to go out with walks with my friends and that because that is very important because you cannot keep on reading all the day you have to take sh- short breaks in between uh, fa- my family and friends uh, supported me throughout my neat pg preparation uh, when i left seat uh, at central institute in december i was very upset uh, i i actually took a break for 5 to 10 days uh, in that i i went with my friends uh, for uh, a small vacation and uh, after throughout my preparation my family and friends supported me a lot so when i made decision to left uh, central institute seat uh, i told my family they they are very supportive at that time they supported me in all my decisions so actually i came back uh, from central institute uh, in december uh, i i was very upset at them at that time so i took a break for 4 to 5 days uh, and then i started preparing again from the january i knew that the last attempt i gave was not uh, my full hearted attempt so i was very sure that if i give my full hearted attempt and with full preparation i will get a good rank Uh, so when I started preparing f- uh, again from the January universe, the first thing I did is I bought Mero Plan C because I knew that uh, Mero Plan C I is used in my last time of preparation and uh, it it was it it was it helped me a lot in my last time of preparation. So I the first thing I did is I bought Mero Plan C and started preparing from that only. Uh, so how I used to uh, solve question bank is. Uh, like if i have read uh, one subject uh, I, i will i will start question bank solving after 2 to 3 3 days of that uh, i used to bookmark uh, like if if a question if a question module contains 25 or 30 mcq so i used to bookmark uh, initially 10 or 12 mcqs and other uh, like sh- small points are there which is missing in notes so i used to keep on adding uh, some points in notes so don't uh, bookmark so many uh, mcqs because it will be very difficult in revising and use uh, there are three uh, different types of bookmarks so I, what i used to do is uh, if uh, the point is very high yielding or expansion is uh, given very extensively or some pulse are attached in that so i used to give that star, star mark or if th- th- something is given in notes but that it is differently explained in uh, mcq so i used to give it in uh, it with a different bookmark so if any time i want to like uh, uh, solve it so i know that uh, this is uh, these are the mcqs uh, Uh, which are differently uh, explained uh, from the notes so the one thing is uh, i don't like making notes so i use mero notes only which is a uh, which is very uh, beautiful uh, because uh, the image quality and uh, image explanation as given is very, uh, very good because if if i make my own notes there will be no images in that so if i want to cross reference cross reference something i need to search for that image so the best thing about mero notes is uh, all images and uh, all explain actually anatomic uh, anatomic cadaver images are, are are also given in that so that are very good active space in the mero notes are also uh, quite adequate so we can add on some points in that also the one one more feature i find uh, which is very useful in mero app is mero pulse so what i used to do is whenever uh, i am solving any uh, gt question or that if mero pulse is attached below that and i find that this is a repeatedly asked question or uh, the pearl is covering like many triads are given in one one pearl or that so i will use to bookmark that pearl 
so at the end of my preparation i have almost 700 to 800 pulse which i have bookmarked and that is two in different uh, features like one is start pulse and one is another is normal bookmark pulse so what i used to do in, in the, my last uh, few days of preparation is last 5 to 10, 10 days is i used to solve marrow pulse only so almost 200 to 300 pulse i used to solve in last uh, 10 days so about Mero GT is what I think is and many people have already said that Mero actually this time of NEET PG exam was actually like it, it felt like it, I, I am giving Mero GT only. So Mero GTs are actually very, resem very resembling to NEET PG and INICT examination. INA, Mero uh, NEET mock and INICT mock are also very like accurate and predicting rank and difficulty in actual exam. The analysis which is given after Mero GT is also very good. We can predict that what are our weak subjects and what are our strong subjects also. And what I what I find best is the explanation after uh, each MCQ. So uh, uh, if one MCQ which I have not heard of and which is, which is asked in Mero GT, but the explanation is given so extensively so I can learn all that topic from that only. The custom module, I used to do custom modules uh, time to time. I used to do custom, uh, make custom modules with previous question uh, like if I want to do like uh, investigation of choice question which are which most people find very difficult so I used to make in custom modules with investigation of choice question or numbers question sometimes some clinical question I want to do then uh, I can make custom modules from that so custom modules are also very good feature of my work. so uh, the previous question mo uh, modules are very useful uh, because uh, everyone knows that when it comes to NICT they ask very repeated question or repeated topic so in the marrow uh, aims uh, previous question they have given extensive explanation so i can uh, learn all topic from that explanation only like uh, uh, if one albert stain is asked in one exam so they have given the whole process of albert stain and the fixative and also we can uh, uh, learn from that one topic is uh, covered in that only so actually uh, i gave one gt in my pre final year which was a free marrow mock i think uh, in my pre final year i got rank around 3000 to 4000 in that from that explain uh, i solved that gt and i came to know that uh, Mero is a very good app and uh, explanation and everything is given very useful. Uh, so in the final year also one, my, one of my senior recommended me about Mero and uh, I, I, then I bought Mero Plan C from my final year onwards. My mother is a housewife and my father is a BMS doctor. I have a one twin brother who is also a doctor so he's always been supportive in entire my journey. So we used to prepare together for uh, entrance examination and also he supported me and my mother and father also supported me throughout my preparation. Uh, when I came back from that uh, Central Institute seat and uh, at that time also they supported me a lot. After your first reading, uh, there should be at least one or two, at least two or three divisions. Uh, at best three or two is also good. But uh, first divisions you should complete in four to five, four months and then you, you can complete your later on revisions in one or one and a half months. Actually, I used to, in, in the later part of my preparation, I used to do question banks with uh, reading of notes. So I used to do uh, at least uh, 30 to 40 questions a day which I already bookmarked or some new topics which I have not solved from the question bank. So I used to do at least uh, 30 to 40 questions at least or 2 to 3 modules in the later part of my preparation. In the initial part of preparation, I used to solve around 5 to 6 modules per day. One thing I want, uh, want to uh, tell my junior is uh, the one who has secured a good rank, uh, congr congratulations to them and one who has not secured a good rank, uh, just analyze uh, your preparation itself. Uh, if you have given your 100% and still you have not good, uh, not get good rank, so uh, don't go for another attempt. And if you have, if you feel that your preparation was not uh, full this time and you have not given your full hearted attempt, so you can always give another attempt. Uh, for the biochemistry, Rebecca Mem is the best. Mem has explained all the concept and topics very uh, easy learning manner. And after each uh, video, Mem gives some motivational quotes and some uh, um, advice, so that is also very useful. Uh, so we had our internship in the COVID time. So at the time time of uh, when we are posted in covid duty zone it was a very hectic time for all so i used to solve marrow custom modules and marrow pearls at that time to uh, keep my preparation on track so i used to solve marrow question marrow question bank marrow custom modules and marrow pearls while i am traveling actually i reside in bhavnagar and i am i have done my mbs from bj medical ahmedabad so when i am traveling forth and back to my home and college i used to solve question banks uh, there also and when we are posted in clinical duties i used to solve question banks uh, while uh, we, i get some free time during that when you feel very exhausted after uh, days of preparation i i would suggest that you should take at least a day, day of a break you you can go uh, watch movies with with your friends or you can go uh, one day for uh, like small picnic or that uh, it will keep your preparation on track
so when i so when i was exhausted so much after days of preparation i used to uh, watch a small series on netflix and i used to small i used to watch a movie or something like that i used to i used to take one day off and then start preparing again from the next day uh, i remember one incident uh, in tenth and i we went to delhi for uh, vacation and at that time we were on delhi tour and they we we went to see aims new delhi so at that time from that time onwards i was very sure that it is the the best institute of the country and i want to get into that